31st, July 2011, food vlog, take a fucking million. I've done this, this portion of the video a thousand good trillion times, and I'm still not getting it right, because I'm tripping all over my words, because I can't think. I don't know. I'm on my way to the gym. Yes, I am. And I'm excited because yesterday was a really good gym day, and today I don't feel too totally shredded. So I'm hoping to do an hour on the elliptical. Yes, I am. And I'm excited because after that I'm done. Grocery shopping got done yesterday, last night. I finished my grocery shopping at 11 o'clock at night. I was like, I just don't want to do this tomorrow. So I did it. Um, yeah, so grocery shopping will be done, and everything will be done. I'm just gonna go home, shower, no, take a bath, yeah. Y'all probably get a bathtub vlog. And I'm going to just hang out and it's gonna be awesome. Um, I'm particularly excited about the gym because I wanted to push. I like when I push. I like how I feel when I burn fuel and I get sweaty and I know that I worked hard every day. I love that feeling. And I have not been able to achieve it the past two weeks. So I'm really hoping that this week can be one of those weeks. I'm figuring gem, gem, Zumba, gem, Zumba, day off, gem. That excites me. So I should be able to do that too. Because Zumba is a break these days. It's crazy because it's a serious workout. It is. But I'm so accustomed to it that I can... Because it's in a group environment, you can't take it an extra step. At the gym, I can take it the extra step. So it's almost like the Zumba days are a break also. All right. Also, because I love, like, when I'm at the gym, I think I've said this before, when I'm running on the treadmill or when I'm on the elliptical, it is just me and God and the solitary confinement of my mind, which is not really... I, like, dude, I don't know if these videos even give you a glimpse into the crazy that is me. It's not horrible to be there because I can go off in my mind. But, um, it's still, it's just like, it's a purifying, like, much more spiritual experience to be alone at the gym, um, in my workout and in my body. But Zumba is like, oh, like, you know, you're hanging out with the girls and you're talking and laughing through it, you're dancing together. So it's a lot different in that way. Ooh, the gym looks totally full. Yay. Not gonna be alone. Means no concerts by Senorita Little Fat. So, <laughs> all right, I'll check in afterwards. It's a bathtub vlog. I told you guys you'd probably get one. It's a bubble bath. Can you see it? That's as low as I'm going. You couldn't see the bubbles? Oh well. Here look, we'll push them up. Bubble bath. Okay. Um, can you see my hair? It's growing back curly. See my whole entire life I have like mixed hair because whether your hair is straight or curly and I am not a hairstylist. This is as best as I can tell. Because I'm hair dumb, y'all. Um, what, okay, I think it's like determined by the shape of your hair follicle. Like the actual shape of the hair. So, I have a mixture of curly and straight hair. My mother used to think it was like cute when I was a child. I had very long hair. And she used to think it was cute to go through and clip the curly ones short so that all around my head there was this thin curly helmet of hair and then I had long hair. How sick is that? That's ridiculous. But anyway, as you guys know, my hair thinned out and like fell out a lot around 50 pounds and it continued to fall out to about 75, 80 pounds lost. 
and now, and then it kind of went dormant, didn't fall out, but didn't grow back, and now I've got all these little babies, these little baby curly hairs, can you see them, like, go right there, all these little baby curly hairs growing all over my head, my mom would be so happy, I'm extra shiny, because I have a mask on, it's a honey, and... Uh, it's a crystallized honey and strawberry. It smells so good. And I love, like, sugar scrubs and stuff like that. So, yay. Uh, and I'm soaking in a tub. Let me tell you guys about the gym, which is why I decided to do this vlog. Okay. I went to the gym. And I hit the elliptical. And I kicked ass on it, but only for 45 minutes. Because, I like, definitely the less you do, the less you can do. And I think from like the last two weeks being so stressful and not being able to work out and last week not even be able to go, I think that I um I lost a little bit of stamina. So I was kind of like, do I take it easy and go the hour or do I bust ass and go 45 minutes? I chose to bust ass and go 45 minutes. I've always chosen to bust ass and go half an hour or more. So... I just figure I'll push myself as hard as I can, and then if it catches up with me and I tire myself out, then I'll switch gears, and instead of doing nothing, I'll do it easy, but for longer. See, I'm trying to psych my body out. It's mind over body over here, kids, and that's what I'm working on. Anyway, um... Yeah, so a lot of you guys got to the end of that rambly video, which means that this might actually get seen. And so you guys rock. Y'all do. Y'all totally rock. I want to do like a, like a live chat, like a live video chat. I've, I've um, Google chatted Ashley, Hair by Ash. I love it. I love to meet you guys. Um, I really like what Melissa from My 100 Pound Meltdown had going on, the, the conference. But I want to do something like that, more like a lounge setting that's just talking, as many video cameras on as possible, and stuff like that. Um, I'm looking into some software, and I'm hoping to be able to do that, because I'd love to be able to talk to you guys. Um, if you have a webcam and a Google Mail, I mean a Google, yeah, yeah, a Google Mail account, then we can web chat, we should do that. Uh, oh, also, I know that, oh, I can't remember her name now, but she's from the conferences, and damn, damn, damn. I know at least one person is in Gulfport, Mississippi, or in that area. I am not in that area, but I can drive there on a good day. If not, I can get a ride there. I'm going to go, I'm going to look for a Zumba instructor who I care for. And then I'm going to go, and I'm going to announce that date, and I would like to get at least one of you guys to meet me out there, and I'm going to start to try to do, like, and I'm not going to do it very often due to money and stuff, but I'm going to start to try to do, like, in this area, I'm doing Zumba at this class at this time, and try to get out there and do some meet and greets, and maybe get some of you guys to Zumba. How awesome is that? It's awesome. Um, Yeah. So, if you are in the southern Mississippi, Louisiana area, if you are close enough to New Orleans to take an hour to drive, or two, or even whatever you're willing to drive to get here, I have a fabulous Zoom class. I will give you the information. We can meet up. We can hang out. We can totally make a YouTube video together. Um, go to my Zoom class, and we can go get something to eat. It'll be fun. So... Yeah, I want to start meeting you guys. It's just, you know, it's time to take this to the next level. I think we've been seeing each other long enough. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, but I, I was looking at for it more like a group. Like I figured, um, oh, it was Bun Three Ken who said she's in Mississippi, but I don't know what area of Mississippi. But if she's anywhere near the the southern parts, then we're gonna try to. I'm gonna try to get her to come. Who else was it? I think it was... Kelly? I think it was. I don't know. I'll let you know when I follow up at the end. Food today. Food today has been amazing. It's been doing so good. 
Um, I've, I've pre-planned everything. I'm home, taking it easy. So I'm really happy with food today. And I really feel like I have my head. I, I think last week was just a series of unfortunate events. So I'm feeling really positive and really happy about that. Uh, yeah, an exercise I'm feeling good about. Today, this week is... Actually, I'm not going to do Zumba Wednesday. That was in my original plan. I have something going on Wednesday night at the Aquarium of the Amer of the Americas. Is that what it is? The Autumn Aquarium? I don't know what it is. It's the Aquarium in New Orleans. My brain just like was like sput sput sputter, and I, in my and in, in, I I had blanks. Oh, it's crazy. Anyway. I'm gonna keep burning this little candle. It's not a trash can. That's not a trash can. That's where the dirty clothes go, just so you know. I'm not bathing next to a trash can. But anyway, I'm gonna keep burning this little candle and I'm gonna soak, soak, soak. And then I'm gonna get um, dressed in, can you see that? My pajamas, which is a big ass sweatshirt and flannel pajama pants because I'm effing cold. And I'm just going to hang out tonight. That's my plan. Not going anywhere. Oh, it feels so good. I'll talk to you guys later.